Howdy folks, Rob Maximum RD here. And uh, let me apologize first on the lighting here. I'm actually out on the, our balcony. It's uh, like 11 p.m., just past 11 p.m. And I was looking at these, which I'm pretty sure are the last of my original ColecoVision cartridges. I have the, uh, the Atari Max, the older Atari Max USB 128 and 1 cartridge, which is awesome, as well as a ColecoVision and uh, the two expansion modules, all kinds of accessories, etc., etc. But these are the last few of my original cartridges because I chose to trade or give away a lot of things uh, in the past that I thought others would appreciate a little more. But I was looking through these original ones that I have left, and don't get me wrong, like many of you, I know a lot about ColecoVision and Coleco in general. It was Connecticut Leather Company and the history, how it all started. And Well, at my age, I lived through the entire ColecoVision uh, uh, popularity and uh, gaming history. But this is something I just noticed while looking through these cartridges. Now, here, you'll notice I have two Donkey Kongs, which, uh, again, I apologize for the lighting here, but I have two Donkey Kongs. Uh, not too surprising, since it was the pack-in cartridge for the system. Probably the one uh, title that most uh, ColecoVision fans own at least one of. Um, but I was looking through them, and I noticed this one thing that I thought was interesting. So, if we look through them all now on the back let me get this in, in view here on the back okay so Coleco it's a little hard to see oh there we go let's see you want to focus no of course you don't come on baby no you don't want to focus because you're a piece of crap there we go touch to focus so made in USA beautiful uh, ladybug Made in USA, Turbo, yeah, I'm sure some of you already know where this is going, Made in USA, uh, Donkey Kong, of course, and Made in USA, and lastly, Frogger, uh, oh, Parker Brothers, oh, okay, well, whatever, so, the difference though, this other Donkey Kong that I have, again, which would have been a pack-in. Uh, maybe some of you can answer, could you buy this game separately at the time, like originally? Could you buy it separately? I'm wondering about that and if that might uh, give some answer to what I'm about to ask here, the difference. But I noticed this one, which is actually in better shape than the other one. But this one, however, says, if you can see, Made in Taiwan. Made in Taiwan. Pretty much, though, it's identical otherwise. Um, I believe if you look at the, the front label there, I think it's pretty much the same. Looking at the front label. Uh, the only real difference I noticed was looking at the top label. So there it says. That's clear... Yeah, iPad. It's not the greatest for camera quality. There we go. Let's zoom in. There we go. Buy Nintendo. Right under the red Donkey Kong, it says Buy Nintendo. And this one does not say that under the red Donkey Kong. It does not say Buy Nintendo. But of course it says it in the front, just as the other one does. So with that, that's my question. Of all these cartridges, all of them say, well, except the Parker Brothers Frogger, all of them say Made in USA, but one of my two Donkey Kongs say Made in Taiwan. So, just by law of averages, I'm going to guess possibly... Whoa, what happened there? <laughs> I'm going to guess possibly that most of the cartridges were produced in USA, and being, you know... Connecticut Leather Company and their headquarters in Connecticut. I'm guessing most of them were made in the USA. So for you guys who know more than I do, 
and I'm sure some of you know the exact answer, what's the deal on the Donkey Kong that was made in Taiwan? Was it, uh, you know, obviously uh, I can only assume that manufacturing is handed out, uh, you know, to be cheaper by getting it produced in Taiwan, or was this something that was right from the beginning? Or after the launch, and uh, what I'm assuming was a successful launch of the ColecoVision uh, in the years that followed, maybe they needed to produce more, so they contracted Taiwan out to, uh, you know, create more cartridges, or was it just, um, was it uh, game, was it a version of Donkey Kong that was sold? That you could buy separately that was produced in Taiwan and just the pack-ins were made in the USA I don't know I'm just I just thought it was interesting and uh, wonder uh, if in, any of you have some more detail or uh, history on that with the Taiwan connection as far as manufacturing goes um, I guess I should have looked at my actual ColecoVision console uh, whether or not that was actually manufactured in the USA were they all manufactured in the USA were any of those manufactured in, in Taiwan or elsewhere so I'm just curious and I'm always wanting to learn more about Coleco in general so yeah any light that any of you can shed on that as far as the uh, countries that manufactured ColecoVision cartridges accessories consoles anything like that why the difference um, and that's it I guess so thanks for watching I look forward to hearing and reading your opinions. Uh, that's it. Rob Maximum RD out.